Our other top story tonight, after a horrible mobile home fire in Sealy, another tragic mobile home fire broke out this morning in the Salton Sea Beach community, destroying two homes. Vanessa Gangora joins us from the scene of one fire with what she's uncovered. Right where I'm standing is where a family of five lost everything in a matter of seconds. And now we're learning another fire in the Salton Sea Beach area did just the same. Fire is continuing breaking out in mobile home parks. Imperial County Deputy Fire Chief says two homes were lost in the Salton Sea Beach community Friday. Thankfully, no injuries reported, but according to the Deputy Chief, one man was transported to the hospital. He says though they don't know the cause of these fires yet, several mobile home fires are caused by electrical issues. It has a X amount of outlets in it, and we tend to demand more from the actual uh, outlet than what it was intended to do. And those are perfect examples of what can cause a fire. Flores says making electric upgrades to mobile homes without professional help isn't a good idea. By adding patios, by adding the extra uh, cart ports, things that they were not intended to, and actually demanding the electrical piece of it from that uh, property can add to the uh, to the danger piece of it. Thursday's fire impacted a family of five, including an eight-month-old girl, ten-year-old girl, and twelve-year-old boy and their parents. The Imperial County Deputy CEO went to the hospital to help the family. They were getting services from the hospital as they suffer burns, uh, second and third degree burns, mm -hmm. and the parents actually cannot walk for now. They are in wheelchairs uh, recovering from uh, the injuries. The boy is on crutches due to burns on his feet, but thankfully the two girls were not injured. Warren was able to help the family get a hotel for temporary housing. The county has a program now that it's for to provide assistance to families they have been affected by um, a situation like this, a fire or an earthquake. Warren says the county tries to keep these funds available on a yearly basis to prevent people from becoming homeless after they lost their home or are caught in a similar situation. Reporting in Sealy, I'm Vanessa Gangora.